I've been living in Asia now for four years, and this is the first time I have ever had a display cabinet in my apartment. So you better believe I will kit this out with as much Halo as possible. Whoa, look at this. This is, it's so beautiful to see, especially with all the Halo. <laughs> <laughs> is it bad? Are you laughing at my hair? It's so beautiful, especially all the Halo Infinite sets. And also, shout out to my hair. Um, apparently, we were cutting it last night and then the razor ran out of battery. So it is a bit of a half-hack job. But look at this, this it's just so beautiful. Today I'm gonna guide you through my Halo Infinite diorama. I hope this will be like a succeeding series where I update you every time I add new figures. And there will also be an additional part of this video that is exclusive to Patreon because those guys are just supporting me. They're unbelievable right now. I wanted to do something to help out. Check out Patreon for loads of exclusive perks. All right, let, let's let's have a look. Pass me the camera. Also, shout out to my my girlfriend with uh, she's literally wearing the light on her head right now as extra uh, it's it's ridiculous here we go look at this this is my halo infinite diorama i'm gonna talk you through step by step the thought process behind this it's obviously greatly inspired by the brand new skiff intercept i just got this set up and i really hope you enjoyed the review of this set yesterday and the speed build two days prior to that this is awesome. I love the alternate build of the Skiff Intercept way more than the original. I've got this little Billy the Grunt. He's operating the turret on the top, and then he's got some reinforcements coming around the back as well. So let's start from left to right. First of all, we've got the Banished, and shout out to my blind bag videos. There are just so many of them now. So many elites and an unbelievable amount of chips dubos. I mean, look at them all. It's so ridiculous. All right, so starting off, we've got the Skiff Intercept alternate build. The Spider is amazing. And then we've got the Grunt on the turret. Round the back, we've got a Grunt and another Elite. And then a Craig the Brute Halo Hero Series 12. We've got the Jackal from the Warthog. He's checking out this Marine who's having his face eaten. There's been a huge flood outbreak here as well. And then we've got the two Brutes from the Skiff Intercept. And a couple of Elites here. This Grunt is sort of just kicking the Chips Dubo on the floor, this Marine's being assaulted by the Elite. The Master Chief is probably my favorite thing about this diorama. He's slinging a grunt through the air while firing down on an Elite, and he's about to square off with Craig the Brute one-on-one. -on -one. Further across, we've got the Elite from the Mongoose. He's about to face off with the Mongoose itself, with those two amazing Marines. I love the Bearded Marine especially. And then we've got another Jackal. He's leading the charge against all these Marines, all these Chips Dubos. This one's firing against the Grunt from the Skiff Intercept. And then this one from the Warthog. There's a couple of downed Marines over there. And usually when there's a downed figure, I just attach a Flood. He's just sucking his face off. And then a couple more are fighting the Flood as well. We've got the Spartan Mark VII from the Skiff Intercept at the back and then a couple more marines, one of them with a plasma rifle. I mean, I just love this diorama. Look at it, it's, there's so much life involved. So much life in this diorama. If you would like a tutorial on how to make this diorama, I'd love to show you guys. And, oh, it's, it's fantastic, it's, it's just so good. It's so good to have this kind of diorama. It's so good to have this kind of display in Hong Kong. I could have never imagined that I would, I mean, let alone have this kind of display cabinet, but also be able to display it with these figures and show you guys on YouTube. My dreams are coming true right now, honestly. And that's it for today's video. I'm about to take this over to Patreon and show you a couple more of these shelves. So if you'd like to see, why don't you head on over to Patreon? Don't feel any pressure to donate, but it's just a way of thanking my fans who are helping me out because finances are tough right now and I really do love your support and any, any support, liking this video, commenting, subscribing, they're all amazing ways to show support as well. We're also having a baller of a time over at the Mega Constructs Domain, our brand new Facebook group, the place to be if you want to chat Halo and just have a good time with the community. And also check out my Discord, there are so many good ways to connect right now, I, I'm in love with this community. Alright, this was another video with The Domain. Thank you very much for tuning in today, and Billy the Grunt is signing off. Come on.